the parliamentary oversight includes uh, checking on expenses uh, that have been done by the executive. And so we would ordinarily already have expected that parliament, uh, the parliamentary uh, audit committee would take a look at these documents and, as it were, arrive at some conclusions and uh, make recommendations. So it is in order. I, I think that beyond the NDC saying so, parliament had a responsibility to do this. So it is good that the minority is saying that we will ensure that this is done and done speedily. And uh, briefly, my last question on that would be, what, do you have any specific expectations in mind of what the minority could do or what parliament generally should do about the Auditor General's report? What outcomes are you I, looking forward to? I, I'm expecting that parliament would endorse the recommendations already are set out by the Auditor General and move the process for it by ensuring that the audit report implementation committees actually work to retrieve sums of money and to get people who ought to be prosecuted prosecuted. Uh, I think that that will be moving the entire process a step forward and to help us retrieve any monies that are uh, sitting in people's pockets or to penalize people who have used monies they ought not to have. Mm. Mr. Senanu, thank you so much. It's a pleasure talking to you, Edem. Senanu, co-chair, Citizens Movement Against Corruption and Anti-Corruption uh, 